Hello everyone. In today's tutorial, we're going to dive into the world of C-sharp programming and create something practical and fun. A simple calculator with a user-friendly graphical interface. Whether you're a beginner or an experienced programmer, this tutorial will help you understand the fundamentals of building applications in C-sharp and give you valuable insights into designing user interfaces. But before we start, welcome to Kadev Tips, your ultimate destination for programming tutorials and all things code-related. If you're passionate about learning to code or improving your programming skills, you're in the right place. But before we dive into today's programming tutorial, I'd like to invite you to become a part of our growing community. If you haven't already, please consider hitting that subscribe button below. By subscribing, you'll gain access to a wealth of programming knowledge and stay updated with the latest tutorials we release. So, go ahead and subscribe now, and let's get coding. Here's a basic c -sharp program that accomplishes this. To create a calculator with a graphical user interface in C-Sharp, you can use Windows Forms, which is a part of the .NET framework. Open Visual Studio and create new Windows Form application. Add the following UI components to the form. One text box for input and result. Buttons for digits, 0 to 9. Buttons for arithmetic operations, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division, and one button for equals. We are done with the UI, now let's add codes to our calculator. First, declare variables. Second, add codes to digits, numbers 0 to 9. Third, add function named evaluate for the output. Fourth, add codes to all operations, addition, subtraction, multiplication, and division. Fifth, add codes for the clear button. Lastly, add codes to equals.
We're done, now let's run our program. And there you have it. I hope you found this tutorial on creating a simple calculator in C-sharp both informative and enjoyable. Building your own calculator is not only a fantastic way to enhance your programming skills but also a practical project that you can expand and customize to fit your needs. If you have any questions, run into issues, or want to share your thoughts, please feel free to leave a comment down below. Your feedback is incredibly valuable to us, and we're here to help you on your coding journey. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to our channel for more exciting programming tutorials, and hit that notification bell so you'll be the first to know when we release new content. Stay curious, keep coding, and remember that practice makes perfect. So, go ahead and experiment with your calculator, add new features, and make it your own. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next tutorial. Happy coding!